Hello everyone, this is Karan from IIT Delhi and I welcome all of you to my YouTube channel. So finally, last two months are left for your IIT JAM 2022 examination. I hope uh, your preparations are going well and uh, in this video, I'm going to tell you some of the mistakes which you should not do in your last two months of preparation. This video is going to be very, very helpful for all the IIT JAM 2022 aspirants. So I will be giving examples related to chemistry, but the advices will be applicable to all the IIT JAM uh, aspirants related to any subject. So let's get started. But if you are new to our channel, then please subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for more updates. So the first mistake which most of the students do is that they avoid revision. I am receiving so many messages in my on my Instagram and Telegram that uh, like bhaiya, we will be completing our syllabus till 30th of January or till 31st of January. So uh, will we start? So I will be starting revision after that, and will we be able to crack exam? So obvious, the answer is no. Without revision, you cannot crack any competitive exam. So if you are not even done with your syllabus, if you are left with so many of chapters, start taking out some time for your revision because revision is the key to success. Okay, start taking out your time for revision. Don't ignore it. Otherwise, you will have to ignore jam for this year. Next is don't avoid test series. Uh, I know many of the people who are in touch with me, they have not even started with uh, test series. They have not even started giving tests. So in this way, you are actually ruining your whole preparation. Because if you are not giving test, you are not assessing yourself that whatever you have studied, are you able to solve those questions or not? Are you able to solve questions of those topics or not? Because the topics which are still left, please leave it now, like leave it for a second, but which you have studied, even if you have studied them and even if you are not able to solve those questions, so what is the use of studying those topics? So first, try out and identify whether you are able to perform in those topics which you have studied thoroughly or not. Otherwise, what is the benefit of studying? If you haven't done it, then remove it. If you haven't done it, you haven't done it, then what is the benefit of studying? So, you have to assess yourself. You have to assess yourself. You have to assess yourself. Okay? Third point is the most important point. Very important. Very, very important. Don't compare your, with your friend or any of the classmate or anyone. Look. The ranks which you get in the test series are entirely going to be different which you will be gaining in the your main examinations. There is no connection at all. So please don't compare with your friend. Don't compare that he or she has studied 10 books or 20 books. You have not studied any of the one because your confidence will be going down. And if your confidence go, uh, goes down, you are actually out of the race. You are out of the race. If you are confident about yourself, then at least half of the race you have won. Okay, so please don't compare with your friend. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter how many books he or she has studied. Doesn't matter how many new questions, how many tough questions the particular person can solve. Don't see at all because aapka IQ level, aapka dimag, aapki capacity is totally different from somebody else. And if you will be pushing or forcing yourself to follow somebody else's routine or anything, you are actually going to destroy yourself. Because if you can body nahi kar sakti, आप forcefully उससे करवाओगे तो there is going to be no use. So I request all of you that don't compare your rank or your preparation or your knowledge or anything with anybody else. Okay, just focus on the relevant topics, focus on relevant questions for jam, focus on revision, PYQs, test series, and just do at your own pace. Don't force your body. Don't force your mental capacity. जिसका जो लेवल है, everybody is unique, so don't force yourself. Okay. Next point is self doubt. That is one of the mistakes that I had done, and that is why I am advising here so that you should not commit the same mistake again. Uh, last year in the month of November, December only, if I'm not wrong, uh, I was solving the questions of reaction mechanism, okay, organic reaction mechanism, and I was not able to solve any of them. I'll be very frank and honest. So that day and actually it was night. That night I was feeling so much of demotivated. I had lost almost all of my confidence that I, and I, I had started thinking that will I be getting even NIT 
will i be securing rank under 500 so that actually hampered my self confidence and i couldn't even study uh, in a better pace for the next 2 3 days which actually led to wastage of some of my time wastage of some of my energies and actually destroyed my mental peace to be very honest so uh, i would be advising you that please don't do this mistake don't do uh, like this mistake don't self doubt yourself do not have any self doubt just follow the law of attraction i don't know whether you will be following or not i follow law of attraction i believe in it wake up in the morning always say to yourself or write in some notebook that you will be performing your best in your jam examination you will be performing your best okay aap apna best doge and you writing write down that aapka paper bahut acha jayega you will be your exam will be very good your exam will be going very good start writing start saying uh, saying it out to yourself uh, in the morning when you wake up and before going to sleep and this will definitely work this will definitely work because a positive vibe will be uh, created inside you definitely go and try this out because i was in one of my i was the in the phase that i was so much demotivated i messaged to my seniors to my friends and asking that uh, kya mera iit ho payega will i be able to crack any even nit so don't do this just start doing this and you will be having some positive energy okay don't self doubt yourself so next is uh, the point which you should focus is you should have confidence in yourself because agar confidence khud mein nahi hai na to kuch bhi nahi ho sakta kya hoga if you are not having confidence then jo questions tough hai chalo wo to honge nahi and if you are not having confidence the easy questions bhi nahi honge you will not be uh, able to solve even the easy questions so you are completely out of the race theek okay? hai just start believing that you can do you can do aur bahut acha jayega paper paper bahut acha jayega you will be performing very well in the examination just start saying it out to yourself okay uh, next point is some students actually messaged me that uh, they are thinking to watch the lectures if they are taking some institute lectures and they are not solving questions like they are saying ki we will be completing the 100% of the syllabus by watching only lectures and not solving questions so this is also a very wrong approach which you should avoid don't do this if you are studying a particular topic do it nicely do uh, the watch the lectures do all the questions previous year questions and everything just avoid this that you are not solving questions because ye theory ka paper nahi hai this is not your delhi university or some other university semester examination in which you have to fill pages by writing all the theory of story or anything you have to solve questions within the time limit so you have to practice questions if you are left with some smaller topics then it's okay but for the important ones don't do this don't do this and one thing more you will not be able to complete the whole syllabus even exam ke baad bhi aap complete nahi kar paoge exam tak bhi complete nahi hoga let me tell you you will not be able to finish anything and uh, any time you can you will be able to see like yaar ye bach gaya yaar ye bhi kar lete hain let let us do this let us do that so don't do this whatever have you covered start revising whatever important is left completed very well otherwise just watching the lectures will not help but that is what my point is you have to practice questions you have to practice questions so the revision test series practice is most important okay next point is next point is don't diverge now like uh, when you hear with your friend he has studied paula bruce or he is solving questions from this particular book he is solving questions from this particular book so what you start thinking like like i will also buy this book i will also take the pdf and start solving because my xyz friend is solving and saying it's very helpful don't do this now it's the time to converge it's the, it's the time to converge not diverge jitna aata hai the, the things which you have studied till now you have to converge that you have to converge that and so that it can come into action so what you have to do whatever have you done till now just revise that whatever is left take out time for that also and start giving test series and pyqs that's it don't just diverge into so many things ki ye naya kar lete hain don't do so many new things now now it's not the time okay now now the next question is uh, the uh, one of my juniors messaged me that bhaiya i am leaving com- organic completely mere se nahi ho payega i am leaving organic completely so don't leave any of the branch completely don't leave any of the branch completely because uh, that will actually let you get a very bad rank so don't do that just do the smaller topics or some topics which you can do scoring topics जो इजी होते हैं हर हर सेगमेंट में ऐसे टॉपिक्स हैं लाइक यू कैन नॉट लीव कंप्लीट ऑर्गेनिक यू शुड नॉट 
you can do goc you can do stereo you can do biomolecules you can do spectroscopy these are something which are not interrelated okay for physical chemistry you can start writing at least formulas at least formulas you can learn for inorganic chemistry bonding is very basic periodic table just you have to learn some trends bio inorganic you just have to learn some of the pages do these topics which do not require you to do so much of hard work okay so don't leave any branch completely i would even advise i would not even advise to leave anything but if you want to but uh, if you want to leave anything if you are weak in uh, very weak in some of the branch then you can do some of the basic topics don't leave it completely at least solve pyqs okay next point is some of the students do that even in my friend circle also there were some of the students who used to say ki hum pyq nahi karenge we will not solve previous year questions they are easy they are that they are that we will not do that and this is very wrong approach you cannot and you should not ignore pre previous year questions so what is the ideal approach you should start solving previous year questions that too in the time bound manner like if your exam is suppose between 3 to 6 pm main exam 13th february if i'm not wrong mine was 3 to 6 okay so i used to give my test i used to give my previous year question in this time duration only 3 to 6 pm only with the proper virtual calculator if you are not having that download the app from play store or you can even search on google that is gate virtual calculator that is same for jam as well so don't do that sorry don't avoid that just do virtual calculator only don't use scientific calculator from now don't use scientific casio calculator from now use the virtual calculator isolate yourself from your family members do leave everything aside from 3 to 6 solve one previous year question paper daily sincerely solve write the down the answers option one uh, on the one page and then after 3 hours just check with uh, whatever you did right whatever you did wrong just write down the wrong things with the concepts with your mistakes in your notebook mistake notebook so that you can revise it one day before the exam that is what you should follow and now the question will be arising how will we revise how will we do test series how will we do pyqs whatever you are studying study start taking out time for revision start take out two hours for revision start revising something say say you are revising stereo chemistry revise 10 pages of the stereo chemistry then in the next day continue with your pending lectures pending work then continue from the same like uh, page where you left stereo chemistry do this revision like this and on the alternate days one day you give test series one day you give previous year question one day test series one day previous year paper like this you can manage everything and uh, just believe in yourself try out to say every time every morning and writing down in a notebook that you will be performing best you will be giving your best and you will be performing very well in your jam exam mai likhta tha ki mai jam mein bahut acha perform karunga maine kabhi rank nahi likhi don't expect the rank don't expect the rank right now don't start day dreaming that mai iit bombay jaunga this won't help i used to day dream about iit bombay which actually never happened so don't dream about any iit any rank anything just give your best believe in yourself uh, and whatever you want me to do for you right now in the two months you can comment down in the comment section we will see you in the later video till then stay tuned with chemistry with karan thank you so much